Right before I became an astronaut, I was a middle and high school math and science teacher in Florida. There's no more important profession than teaching. I mean, it's the most important uh, job out there. It's just something that kind of called me. I was drawn to it, and once I started, I knew that was the job that I really wanted to have and I was meant to have. So we're both excited to be kicking off the year of education in space with astronauts Joe Acaba and Ricky Arnold. We're currently living in the uh, year of education on the International Space Station. It started when I launched back in September. NASA astronaut Joe Acaba making his third flight into space. I stayed up until the end of February. When I left, Ricky Arnold, the other educator astronaut that we have at NASA, he launched, so we have this one-year time period where we have an educator up on the International Space Station. When I talk to teachers, what I want to do is just encourage them to continue with their work. I mean, there's just so much that goes into teaching, so I'd just like to go out and thank them for what they do and just to remind them of how important their job is. If you talk to any little kid, they love space and they love exploring. That's what they do every day. So it's a very kind of an easy topic to talk to kids about, but it's an important one that we can use to help inspire them to kind of follow their dream, whatever it may be. When we're on the space station, we have the opportunity to talk with students that are on the ground and actually show them what it's like to live in space, what it's like to float. We're just regular people. Uh, you know, we had dreams and we worked hard to get there. If we can share our story and our passion for science, you know, I think that might rub off on some of the students and hopefully inspire them to do the same thing. My name's Joe Acaba. I'm a NASA astronaut.